Hey guys, it's Maggie from Rock Paper Copy. In this video, I will show you how to edit URLs in your Shopify store. So you can edit URLs for your products, pages, collections, and blog posts. And in this video, I will show you exactly how to do it. And remember, if you like what you hear, hit the like button below and subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular SEO and e-commerce news. Also, hit the bell button to be notified every time I upload a new video. Now let's get started. So first of all, let's explain why editing URLs is so important. It's because Google prefers shorter URLs and Shopify by default has very complex URLs, especially for products. It's because your product title is displayed in full in your URL and having simple and very easy to understand URL will help you improve your SEO easily and help you boost your organic traffic from Google. Also remember, it's much easier to edit your URLs at the very start of your store because editing URLs later on, after a few years of running your website, will mean that you will end up with a lot of broken links because people finding you through previous URL will see a lot of error pages on your website. So while Shopify creates automatic redirects, the mistakes happen. So if you edit URLs, remember to check for any broken links afterward and fix them as soon as possible. Okay, so how to edit your URL? I'll show you on the example of the product. So go to your Shopify admin and click all products and click on individual product you want to edit. Then simply scroll all the way down to the search engine listing preview at the bottom. Click edit website SEO. And at the bottom, you can see the URL you can edit. Now simply remove the section you don't want, leaving only the element you want in URL. Also make sure that the create URL redirect below is ticked blue. Otherwise, Shopify won't create automatic redirect for you. And remember, it could be the name of the brand, it could be your keyword, it could be a single or two or three, up to three words. I don't recommend going over three words because as you can see, default URL is already quite long. And this is just for the product. For the collection, it would be name of the collection, then products, and then your product URL. And then when finished, simply click save. Please do me a great favor, like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for the algorithm and hit the bell to get notified every time I add new video. There's new video coming every week on Tuesdays and Fridays. Also check the other videos shown here and see even more clips on my YouTube channel. Speak with you soon. Bye bye.